What's going on traders? This is Mike with Tactical Traders doing some end of the day scans on September the 28th and right now I am looking at ticker symbol SPCE and we have the daily chart pulled up over the past uh, about six months of price history. And as you can tell by the chart, uh, this thing can move at some really good range. Uh, so excellent for trading. And in the last few months, I'm going to just zoom up a little bit more. Nice movement all the way up to uh, roughly, we're going to say 26, it did go higher for the most part, about right around 26 for the highs. And then pulling back down um, kind of in this uh, descending triangle pattern right here. Uh, and then finally breaking out. And just in case you don't see that, that pattern I just mentioned, uh, I'll just draw it up real quickly. Um, so it had some, there we go, had some support right here uh, around the 16 and then off these uh, highs. I'm actually going to start it right over here because this was a little bit of a, a crazy time right here. But the pattern started forming and as you can see the range got tighter and tighter. Uh, then finally broke out with incredible volume today, great volume. Uh, probably the most in the last three months, maybe a little bit more. But so yeah, great volume, great uh, gap up and bullish engulfing candle on the daily. But let's zoom up right now to more of an intraday chart and see what we're looking like. All right. So we had that nice gap up, like I said. We opened up roughly a little bit over 18. Price still continued to move straight on up. And then uh, started to go um, kind of in a bullish pennant, uh, pennant pattern right here. Kind of a consolidation um, pattern as well. Uh, but this is just putting in higher lows. So pretty interesting right here. Pretty bullish and a strong move. You can see we also have a uh, an imminent golden cross uh, forming over here with the SMAs. So w with this one, it's going to be a little bit tricky. Um, you know, I would actually recommend this for more for a momentum uh, or day trade at this at these levels if you're going to trade it. Now, I, I do these analysts off the cuff, so let me just resume up for a little bit. I just want to see. All right, so yeah, right around 21. So it looks like we have 21 in resistance for the daily. I'm going to just draw these areas up. Uh, yeah, right there. So you can see on that data point there, the main body of this candle here as well. And then it's, you know, it's a little bit shy of where we were at on our highs today. But so, yeah, definitely be watching the 21 area. Look for that to break with the increase of volume at the same time. That increase of volume is really going to be key to show that it has a, a strong movement behind it. However, for me, um, I would also be looking... For this to hopefully maybe pull back a little bit, uh, maybe to the 1950 area, to the 1950 to 19, I mean, till $20 area. Uh, and then actually I would prefer more to go long rather than wait for this breakout. Uh, this price action has been great. So is the volume. I would just like to see a little bit more of a pullback uh, and then just retest some support somewhere uh, before going long in that. But definitely be watching that 21 area for the upside. And if you're looking for more of a swing trade setup, uh, maybe start collecting around the 1950 area if the price does allow. All right, traders. Well, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more. Uh, we are offering a free 30-day trial to our chat room. You can check out that and the details below. Until next time, traders, stay profitable.